hello everyone welcome again and today in this demo i'm going to show you how can we solve an error in a spring boot like invalid property of bean classes rotatable or has an invalid data setter methods uh, in spring boot like if you are working on any spring boot application uh, you might face this issue um, this error so to solve this error there are two way uh, so the first thing like uh, you have to make sure like your data and setter should be uh, proper annotated or if you are using if you are not using Lombok plugin then you have to create the manual data setters like uh, like this okay you can see it here and in practical also we'll see the things at some time and the, another thing from where this error can be come this is a mismatch of your JSP form uh, names in the path name while you binding it from MSE or uh, uh, it's a mismatching with a variable or the table formatting so let's see in the practical if I move I was working on my project and I got that error so that's why I'm recording this video so I'm gonna run this my project uh, Spring Boot application and let's make these changes and suppose how this error is coming over there it will be easy for you also to understand so let's suppose I have a show view here we are showing some forms some input forms and uh, not understand the requirement we are just going to focus on like how can we solve this errors okay so this is application okay yeah, i'm working so in upcoming days some projects is coming okay uh so okay when i hit the soap uh add soap uh, you can see this uh image and like this this input form and currently it's working fine so let's suppose uh, I'm going to go on my form section and in the form section I'm going to uh, view a form for this shop page and I'm going to remove my getter setter actually uh, I'm using getter setter annotation because I'm using the Lombok plugin in my ID so it's automatically created on the getter setters for me so no need to create getter setter so I just removed the getter setter from the form and if I refresh it if I replace the page, I will get the same error like this. Okay, invalid property short name bean. It means it's not uh, able to find the bean with this uh, name. So always when you map on uh, like your form, uh, JSP forms uh, like a Spring MC form. So then you have to make sure your form should have a getter setter annotation other or other option. Like if you are not using the Lombo, uh, you can create the getter setter like this just i'm going to remove this and right click and like go over the open space right click here in the open space go to source and just create getter and setter select it and select all and create generate automatically it will create the getter setter for the required parameters here and i save it and i'm going to just refresh it again so now if you see it's working fine also now the one thing is that and the other thing is that make sure what whatever the variable you are using the uh, with the form the variable name shop name or owner name or contact name this should be exact match uh, with your form so uh, let's move to the shop view form here we are using binding and we were binding this form with that form so here if you notice we are passing the name of the variable of those fields here like shop name and path name and, and also we are mapping this input so this name like the name of this uh, path should be same as we define into our form variable here so let's uh, incorrect something and let's take this i'm going to change it as a double p and let's try to run it now it will definitely give an error um, so the same thing like the property is not found the invalid property for this so it means it's not find, able to find this property for that variable because we didn't make it, uh, it with this so now that the, the variable name should be same or uh, you make sure your form is using proper get analysis okay uh, so there are these are the two way that we have also i have uh, mentioned into this article and added the code uh, so you can uh, have a look uh, link in the description box link is available into the description box so you can just go out 
and check the code over there and you can use it and if you are getting any other error or you are facing something some issue so uh, you can add it in comment box so we'll try to make we we'll try to solve those errors and make videos on that so you can get help from it okay thank you so much for watching